what's up guys it's Zach welcome back to another video today we got a very special one this is the first NBA 2k 25 pack opening shout out to NBA 2k they had me out to Massachusetts I got to play the game early on community day um, chop it up with some other creators it was awesome uh, one of the best community days I've been to so far and I've been to like six I believe but anyway we got some packs that we were able to open um, they kind of juiced them for us not gonna lie it's pretty dope, but uh, no frills, nothing extra. Get right into it. Let you guys see the cards, see the card art. Now, keep in mind, this is an early build of the game, but these cards will probably be in the game eventually. Like I said, some of them are juice right now. So like the Galaxy Opals, probably not going to get day one, but these cards, most of them will probably end up in the game at some point. So, you know, you get to see them early. You get to see their stats and stuff early, but let's get right into it. First up, um, we got 15 cards or 15 packs that we could open one card in each pack first one I didn't know that the first pack that I opened was gonna be the best player that I get this whole time All right, this card. I mean It, it was unstoppable Everyone was complaining about it because you you weren't guaranteed to get all the cards There were more cards that were available than what we got 99 strength center big shack diesel this card Bro, people were like sitting paint on this card and he was finishing on everybody. Whether you're cheering on your alma mater or you just love the thrill of college football, you're gonna wanna listen to this. I partnered up with DraftKings and they have a special offer that is perfect for game day. Right now, all new customers who bet just $5 will get $250 in bonus bets instantly. Now that's something we can all celebrate, so make sure you download the DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Use my promo code ZachTTG and the crown is yours. That's $250 in bonus bets instantly after betting just five. And you can stay in on the action and use that $250 in bonus bets to bet on anytime touchdown. DraftKings is the place to bet touchdown. Now if sports betting is not available yet in your state, don't worry, you can still get in on the fun with DraftKings Daily Fantasy where you can win cash prizes. So download the DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Link is down in the description bets just five dollars will get 250 dollars in bonus bets when using my code zach ttg only at DraftKings. finishing on everybody okay take that how you will whatever this card was crazy all right i mean a little warriors logo i don't even know how i got that um but yeah five galaxy opal five pink diamond five diamond I'm gonna open up all these cards in this video. Second Galaxy Opal. I don't remember who I got second. Who did I get? Now the card opening animations are super dope. You got the Galaxy Opal rock, hits the floor, and then it shows you like one of their stat. I remember who this was. It can only be one man. It can only be one man. This card was also crazy. Now, small guard, 6'3", but I mean a Steph. He can shoot like crazy. Uh, he was super fast. He was dunking. This Steph Curry car was dunking everything. Like there, there wasn't very many layups. It was all dunks with this card. Third card here, another Galaxy Opal. I, I really like the animation, man. I'm not gonna lie. This 2K has like the most potential of any 2K in like five years. I said it, five years. 98 driving dunk. This was, oh yeah. This card was crazy too. This Giannis, people were um, people were shooting with this card. I couldn't shoot with them, but people were like in the corner just swacking with this card. Like I said, me personally, I couldn't make anything with them, but I mean, it's Giannis, you got Euros, you got the hop step dunks, like it was literally unstoppable. Now, I do remember this, 2K hit me with the cheese. Off rip, first time I touch the game, I get hit with the cheese, all right? dupes dupes i got another shack another shack now this one was holographic so i couldn't have been too mad but come on man like give me give me like five guaranteed card because bro there were so many other cars there was a kareem there was a lebron that i didn't get to get uh galaxy opal there was i'm pretty sure there was a galaxy opal kd i go over all the cars that were available at the end of this um I, I had to quick sell the other one um gotta keep the holographic i mean first holographic at 2k the card art is super crazy this year i really like the card art it was good last year too i'm not gonna lie um 
And then this happens, bro. Day one. Day one. I'm hit with the cheese, bro. Like, <sighs> give me Braun, man. Give me Braun. Give me KD. Give me Kareem. Give me somebody. I got three shacks. Three shacks. Now, 7 1. Here's the stats here. At a D3 point, I mean, I pause it so y'all can see this. Um, bro, the mid range was actually pretty good on this shack. Like, you could hit mid range with this card. The three point, not so much. Uh, free throw, I was shooting free throws with them. It, it really wasn't that bad. Um, standing dunk, driving dunk. I mean, like I said, he was he was literally dunking on everybody. Now the 86 ball handle, okay. The defense, are, we already know that's going to be crazy. But the 86 ball handle, keep that in mind. All right. The 92 speed and the 86 speed with ball, 92 agility. This card was so fast. I would just, like, literally, if he didn't take it out, out of bounds, I would throw it to Shaq and just let Shaq run. He was, like, he was blowing past everybody else's centers, man. It was nuts. This Shaq was, I'm telling you. Like I said, everybody was complaining about this card that didn't get it because you weren't obviously guaranteed all the Galaxy Opals. The people that didn't get Shaq, they were mad. Some of them reset the game. They had the devs reset their game so they could try to get the Shaq because this card was so OP. I know y'all don't really care about the 10Ds, but I went through those too. I mean, this card was dunking everything. Um, he was finishing everything at the rim. He didn't miss layups, bro. He, It was nuts. So here's the badges, all right? It came with 15 Hall of Fame badges, eight gold, as you can see. Posterizer, obviously crazy. Um, you also have Legend badges this year, which are gonna be super OP. You got Rise Up, Aerial Wizard, Post Lockdown, Pogo, Box Out Beast, like Rebound Chaser, all the good stuff. Immovable Enforcer, uh, Paint Prodigy, Physical Finisher. You guys can pause this if you wanna see more of it. Um, Lightning Launch, which is literally, that's why he was blowing by. Like, I mean, you could do like, you could do the like behind the back with this shack and then it wasn't like a crazy speed boost but you could low-key speed boost with this shack it was nuts all right so opened up all the galaxy opals onto the pink diamonds um like i said i got to play with all these cards so i'll tell you guys how i felt about them the galaxy opals were amazing these pink diamond cards were really good as well uh let's see who this is again the animation awesome Eastern 94 pass accuracy. Who was this? Was this Penny? It was Penny. This Penny card, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I did not like. I did not like this Penny card. His shot was not great. He was great on defense, I will say that, but he just wasn't, he wasn't quick enough for me. Now we were only playing the triple threat, which is three cards, so maybe he's better in fives. I didn't get to play fives with them, so I don't know but the penny, it wasn't my favorite. 93 mid-range, small four, Paul George, right? Bro, listen, Paul George does not have his snatch back. I don't know if it was just this card or what, or if he just doesn't have it at all. Paul George does not have, and if you use Paul George in past years, you know what I'm talking about. You're running down the right side of the court, you do that cheesy snatch back and you pull up, it's super smooth. He doesn't have it, bro. I tried everything. I looked everywhere. I could not. I, I literally, any any button combination that I could, I tried to do it. He doesn't have it. It was a very big disappointment for me because I love Paul George cards. And he just, he didn't have it. I didn't like a shot anyway. So I didn't end up using him too much. Um, but I did try him out. And he's super athletic, super quick. So, you know, depends on your play style. But I like to shoot with my uh, with my small forwards like that especially in triple threat 98 driving layup point guards who is this oh bro this iverson card this iverson card was so fast bro um kind of got exposed on defense because he was small again another year the small guards is going to be tough to use outside of that curry um but the iverson didn't get along with his jump shot he was super quick though he was super quick he was great at passing um, great in the lanes. He, he stole the ball a lot, but I mean, he just, he would just get exposed on defense too many times. Too short, just way too short. 
95 driving layup. Did I get duped? I did get duped. I got duped on the pink diamonds too. Who'd have thought? Who'd have thought? Duped on the pink diamonds, day one of the game. Ronnie was there. I said something to him, like, bro, I'm getting duped cards. He was like, you know what I'm saying? He went like this. And he like he told me to shut up. So it is what it is. Nah, Ron Ronnie was cool. I got to chop it up with Ronnie too. Um excited for the future of 2K, man. From from what I was hearing, I'm excited for the future of 2K and excited for this year. Uh Grant Hill, this card was solid. He wasn't as quick as PG, um, but he was solid. He was very solid. On to the diamonds. cannot remember 86 ball handle western point guard was this the throwback it was this was a throwback dame now this card i really liked his shot and his shot off the dribble was super smooth too i mean that's any dame card but i did like that damian lillard card but everybody was playing with galaxy opal so it wasn't like a lot of us were running cards like that but we did have a little competition at the end where you had to like you had to have a galaxy a pink diamond and a diamond and a lot of people were using that um were using that damian lillard this card bro this card i gotta pause this bro this aaron gordon card was literally the greatest card the greatest like lower tier this diamond aaron gordon was is nuts bro he was nuts i was shooting threes with him I was dunking with them. I was getting rebounds. I was guarding centers on the switch offs. This card was so fast, bro. And not a lot of people used them. I don't think anybody else in the competition part used them. This was my diamond that I used, bro. This Aaron Gordon card was nuts. This card was crazy. He's so fast. His dunk animations are super glitchy. Um, I mean, I can't say enough about this card. I can't wait for this card to come out in the actual game because I will be rocking with them. That card was awesome. That was probably one of my favorites. Shaq was by far my favorite, but the Aaron Gordon was one of my favorites, definitely, of the day. Next one here. I can't say it enough. I love the animation. Maybe it's just because it's new, but whatever. 87 three-point shot. Did I get duped again, bro? Every tier. I got duped on every tier. Can you believe, well, I'm not gonna ask if you can believe it because I know you can't believe it. I got duped on every tier. Every single tier, I got duped. <sighs> Troll cards, man. And they only gave us five packs, so I'm like, bro, you don't have to troll us, man. Let us, you know what I'm saying? Let us play with all the cards. 98 Hustle, Eastern Conference, Power Forward, Celtics. This KG trash <laughs> i'm not gonna lie kg was trash i tried the card i didn't like him trash bro not good and i'm pretty sure i got him again right here i do remember this dude the kg was man i'm not a huge fan of kg cards but this card was not it bro not it he was getting exposed by everybody his jumper was wacky like he wasn't he wasn't fast so it was like it's it was basically played like an undersized center so here's all the diamond cards you could get that chet was nuts bro i did play against that chet he was so good the ray allen i played against him he literally didn't miss um i didn't get to play against the Embiid. i played against the boogie the boogie was pretty good uh the dirk was nuts the donovan mitchell was so good um i didn't play against any of those other ones there and then the Galaxy Opal cards. This LeBron was fake, bro. The LeBron was so fake. It was such a good card. I didn't get to play with him. I played against him. He was nuts. This Jordan card does not miss mid-range. He was also a glitch. Uh, the Curry card, like I said, I got him. He was amazing. Um, the Kareem, I played against Kareem. Great card. Not as good as Shaq, but still a good card. The Kevin Durant, they fixed Kevin Durant's jumper. I'm gonna say it, they fixed his jumper. 
It's so good. Last year it was broken. I didn't. I don't think I. I barely played with a KD card last year. Didn't play the game a whole lot, but when I did, <laughs> I wasn't using Kevin Durant. This Kevin Durant is night and day, bro. His jump shot is fixed. Somebody else had him. I don't know who it was at Community Day, but I kept running into him, and they were killing me with this Kevin Durant, bro. I don't think. I think I beat him. I think we went 50% against this KD. I think I beat him like four times. They beat me four times, but even the times that I did beat this Kevin Durant, he still had the majority of the other team's points. He's so quick. You guys know he can take off from anywhere. His dunk animations are nuts. They fixed his jumper. It was amazing. The Shaq, bro, best card in the game. Real quick, I'll show you guys this too. This is what it looks like um, when you're leaving the shop, when you load into you guys will recognize this the old rivet city park i'm so happy they brought this back is only for from what i know it's only for the my team park um i think that's what they're calling it but basically it's like it's triple threat and you can play there's different courts so you have sports that have one spot um and the courts that have one spot you go to those and you play against one other person and you use three of your cards the other courts they have six spots so It'll three people on one side, three people on the other side, just like park. And then you only use one card. You only use one of your cards. Now, if somebody else has the same exact card. I'm not sure how it works. Like maybe it's whoever steps on the spot first gets first dibs at that card. But you also have like a, your second choice card and your third choice card. But man, seeing Rivet back, it brings back crazy memories. I'm so excited for the game this year. Um, I, like I said, man, I can't say enough about it. But that's gonna do it for the pack open. If you guys wanna see the gameplay footage that I have, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment down below saying you wanna see that gameplay. And I'll do another reaction for that, show you guys some of the footage that I got to capture. But anyway, thank you guys for watching the video and I'll catch you next week on the game. Peace.